live on the live with Clivers show talking watches and talking life yep yep if you haven't seen the video on the Archie luxury channel the mercedes-benz disaster has happened guess what happened Clivers? um you bought one then the day after you found a cheaper one mercedes-benz releases a deal the day after we took delivery where they're throwing in free metallic paint they're throwing in a sunroof bigger wheels and I'm just fucked off. I'm just really fucked off about it. So no matter what you buy, you get a better deal. Speaking of fucking stupid deals, speaking of fucking stupid deals, I've asked a few friends about this. Every friend of mine has said to me, fuck me dead. Fuck me dead. This is what they've said. Mark Goldberg, they cannot believe you traded a Porsche Macan S for a Ford. My, as one of my friends said, it's a Ford. They're a piece of shit. And he bought it new. Didn't Mark Goldberg, one of my purists, came back to me and said, Mark Goldberg said he always buys used. He doesn't buy new. What were you doing buying a new one, Mark? Well, the uh, the particular edition that I bought is not even available used. There's technology. I'm sorry. $3, $3 super chat. Michael Ferguson. They Mercedes, Mercedes fucking Benz. By the way, as as Archie, as you know, mm. Mark has just released a video just now. So he's finally... he's. It, no, not finally. He has reached 5,000 subscribers. Woo! Well done, Mark. And did you buy any of those, unlike some assholes in the watch game? How many no. did you buy, Marky? I, I uh, bought only bought 4,999 of them because my mother signed up free, although she insisted I pay for lunch. But um, no, I, I wouldn't even know how to buy subscribers. I, I mean, I'm sure it can be done, but I don't, I don't know how to do it. So, And... And is there a truth through the rumor that upon reaching a uh, 6,000 subscribers, you're going to give away one of your Rolexes to a lucky recipient? Um, no, it was at 4,000, and I was giving away a free fisting, and uh, you never cashed the coupon. But uh, please do remember, I love gray men. I love gray men. <laughs> well fisted. Well fisted. Yes, thank you. Um, so listen, the Ford, there was a, there's technology on the, uh, on the 18 that there isn't on the 17. That was important to me, and um, uh, I know it seems like a really oddball move, but I'm constantly now hauling dogs around in crates. So it um, it was a, it was a, it was really good timing for me to have a larger vehicle, which I could use to haul large. What the fuck is that? Paul, for God's sake! Sorry. Okay, uh, five dollars super chat from Tanzil. And sorry. Mark, congrats on 5,000 subscribers. Give me th three good reasons why your Pelagos, oh, he's watched it too, is better than Archie Salida-based Tag Heuer Indian Dinner Diaper Shitter. <laughs> uh, mine's, mine's blue, so there's that. Mine is made by the sister company to Rolex, and it has this nifty hand oh. would, would, you, would you like to see an, it, a, sorry, I apologize. I was going to say... Do you want to see a new episode, Archie Luxury, live and personal? Yes. You're going to what? I'm going to let you in on a little phone call I do. I do consulting, and I'm just about to ring someone and just tell them a few little home truths in Archie's usual way. What is that music? It's oboe. You know oboe? It's very loud. It comes and goes, but it, it, it gets I'll too turn loud. it off. I'll turn it off. Just you just cover me for 20 seconds. I we can easily cover you for 20 seconds. Who knew that that Paul Pluta would have an oboe fetish? Isn't that basically like a skinny flute? Like Well, I I was figuring it would be more like an elbow fetish, if you know what I mean. No, the elbow would be more like a um you know what? That's an attractive elbow that I got there. I got it. That's a hairy one. Um, no, I think the oboe has this little tiny piece that goes in your mouth, and I'm not even sure that it's a woodwind instrument. Is it? Is it a reed instrument? The, the oboe. Alexa, really is the oboe a woodwind or a reed instrument? <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's why All right. I, uh, I can't no, hear that. Yeah. It seems to be. Well, <laughs> what is that noise? Paul, Paul, where, where are you, Paul? Are you in the hospital? 
I'm in the lounge room of my home, you know, my home. I now, I, I got to tell you, I got to make this phone call. Do you want to listen in? Do you want to eavesdrop or not? Take all the pressure off. I don't yeah, know what's going to happen if there's a super chat, though, but we'll do our best. Oh, let me just ring. I'll just ring this fucker now. I do personal consulting. Okay, now just, just excuse any swearing I do have in this because he needs to be pulled into line. Raymond Foster. He needs to be pulled into line. <laughs> now he's not going to answer. <laughs> also, I, now guys, he can't take my call. The fucker can't take my call. Also, guys, if you want Archie to uh, prank call any other watch gurus, please super chat generously. By the way, I want pizza today too. I want pizza. So if any of you guys want pizza, it ain't free, sunshine. Oh, let's give us a fist. Everyone, hey, is hey how are you? Man, man, you're Indian. You fucked me over on the deal. You fucked me over on the world time, right? I, I can't see how you have a conscience now for your slimy fuckhead friend who needs to be told. Your slimy fuckhead friend needs to be told he's not a fucking friend. He's not a fucking friend. He's a cunt. Do you understand that? Fuck me dead. Do I need to explain the basics to an Indian? I need to explain the basics to an Indian in negotiation. Put on speakerphone, please. I'm telling you, right? You get so many minutes of time with me when you paid that two hundred dollars. Why waste it on garbage about gold-plated Amigas, girl-sized thirty-four mil watches, and if it's a bad deal, you're Indian. Come on, come on. You're a if you don't fucking improve, I'm going to report you to the the the, the Taj Mahal, okay? Because you're embarrassing. You know it's a shit deal. It's a crap deal. How many times do I need to tell you it's bullshit? But you understand, man. You don't need me to tell you it's a bad deal. I mean, Clive and Mark are not. He's not a friend, and you're feeling guilty about telling a friend it's a bad deal. Geez, you didn't have any problem stiffing me up the asshole. That's for sure. <laughs> also, if you would like to have t your own telephone consultancy with Archie Luxury, he ain't please. your friend. Do you understand PayPal, this? He $50 is not your Archie friend. Car dealers, let me explain it to you. Car dealers, Jehovah's to, Witnesses, Amway salespeople are not your friend. If you want a friend, you buy a fucking a dog. Do you understand that? You, you want a dog, you buy a dog who preferably doesn't shit in your four-wheel drive. $50, you can have your own racist rant on YouTube. I mean, come on. Do I need to tell no. you this? You're wasting minutes. Oh, These are valuable enough, credit time on stupid questions. You know the answer. Other than your own, the rates go up accordingly. But for $50, you, you are, insult You understand. Me. I mean, it's a bad you deal. How many times do I need to tell you? It's not a good deal. It's not a good deal. He's not a friend. He's not a friend. Possibly family. WWC White Stick Milgoss. I'd probably make you 10 on it. I don't think they... Well, uh, look. No, look, I, I, I think actually, I Mark, I, mean, I think it's going to be all right I, because if the, the guy's in the problem? Is deep, or in Hindu, so really, as a horned as a horned animal, Archie should almost have godlike status to him. I would just like to state that I'm I, I don't know exactly. Of the but, of the the I had to deal with. I'd want to make ten thousand because you're the hardest son of a bitch I've ever dealt with. I, I wouldn't do anything less than ten Fiverr, if I was selling you something. Fiverr, it's torture. By international treaty. Oh, no, but, but I can't believe. Why do you okay. feel guilty about yeah, stiffing this I mean, car? Come on, please play five dollars super it, chat. It's it's five overpriced. Tucson, I sent you the text out loud so Archie could hear it on his email. Well, Tanzil, your wish is my command. Otherwise. Oh. Archie, your new flat meat eats the carpet. Will this force the Beatles to take up new lodgings? Yes, in, in, the, in, the, in the roommate's large intestine tract. Okay, here we go. From Tanzil, I'm sorry. Oh, dear God, he's muted himself. Thank God. That was a little embarrassing. All right. Well, let me try. Let me try. Actually... While he's in the background, let me try to see if I can play this. Maybe well, if I play it on the computer I'm on, that's not muted. Hold on. Do, 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 do. Mm. 
I'm sorry, what? Clyde, you and me dancing on camera brings this show to a to a worse low than Archie's racism, I think I fear. Well, no, actually I think Tanzil is kind of something. So as long as he's kind of something. So yeah. So actually, actually, when you think about it, he is he is a something guy paying white guys to play this. So there's totally not anything racist about it. And yeah. Well, I think Tanzil, well, let me ask you, Tanzil, I would like to super chat you a question. Um, are, are you a self-loathing Southeast a South Asian? <laughs> That's what I'd like to know. And can we, and if not, can we possibly send a hitman with a nerve agent to Brisbane? Just a thought. Anyway, nice. so um, listen, I just uploaded a, a video to my channel um, in which I uh, in which I asked the question, why is the Submariner, the Rolex Submariner, any better than the Rolex Pelagos? And I'm really not sure that, that it is. I think it's all about the, the marketing budget, the cachet, the classic look of the Submariner versus the Tudor. But uh, what do you think, Clyde? The, the, this is, um, the, in, in many ways, this is definitely a superior watch to all those pre-ceramic ones that people are... Are, are spending more than you could get this one brand new with a three-year warranty. What do you think? Well, okay. You know how normally I like to wear watches to antagonize Archie? Yeah, this is true. That Usually they've come off of a corpse that's barely warm, but true. Right. Well, in honor of you reaching 5,000 subscribers, I'm wearing a watch to irritate you. <laughs> what is it? I can't see. Oh, <laughs> I I know where you bought it. <laughs> did it well, how did yeah. you get it? To, how did you pay, how did you get it past Canadian customs? <laughs> well, you know, um, Ving's it, Cardinal Ving. Thanks a bunch, buddy. We'll just leave it at that. Super oh, chat. here's Doctor Bruce, and there's a super chat. Oh yes, I see it right here. Archie, your voice is so falsetto today. Are you okay? Said Miss Jean. Well, Archie can't hear you right now. He is falsettoing. To the, to did we? third party but should i go ahead and put that on uh should i go ahead and just redo the video from scratch and just put it on the channel pin on video or not i didn't understand the question well you know the uh <laughs> the uh, super chat by tan zeal oh okay okay let's let's do it let's do a little poll okay Okay, Fister's in the audience. Let's also acknowledge some people. Dr. Bruce, thanks for joining us. Now, uh, Herman Ingram, Rob P., Bruce. Raymond Foster, the usual manning the board. Actually, Bruce someone does man the board, surprisingly enough. Bruce dropped uh, out. Okay, well, there's the surprise. Okay, and he joined back. us again. Okay. Uh, also, Jay Fister, Ithaca, New York, Herman Ingram, David R., Victor C., Ricardo Reyes, Sch Schnitzel von lichen <laughs> Listen, listen, Clyde, I'm a little concerned about Dr. Bruce's medical license, and I'm going to tell you why. Because Dr. Bruce, correct me if I'm wrong, but have you taken the Hippocratic Oath? <laughs> sure. Okay, so I'm a little concerned about the do no harm clause and your presence on this channel, because Clyde and I took no such oath, so we are not, we are not morally, ethically, and legally bound from participating on this channel, but I am not so sure. Well, uh, no, 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 no. Actually, no, I, I actually took it myself, my own solemn pro I mean, professional oath. And you're an officer not, of the court, that's true. It's, 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 no, no, it's not to inflict any harm unless I'm getting paid. Oh shit, I'm violating my oath. Damn it. Well. Actually, you're an officer of the court, so I'm really not sure what your status is here. But the whole do no harm thing on Hippocratic Oath really, you know, really concerns me in this instance. Oh, okay. I'm going to have to rewrite it. Um, I've, I've always thought it was do no harm to patients. You know, you might be right and might be onto something. I, I might have been screwing up all along. Well, I don't know if that's specified. You better have a lawyer look at that. Do you know one? That's no, not a sister. Probably does not. I myself, I myself do not. Super chat, Tansil and sorry. Dr. BBW, do you recommend a hearty Bombay chicken curry to keep a delusional sh Shalita shitter wearing YouTube watch guru regular, uh, regular on his bowel movements, 
or just simply wearing the shit out do it that itself. <laughs> Tan cells in great form today. I have, a question. I have a question for Dr. Bruce. Dr. Bruce, do you take turmeric? You take it. Yes, I do. How did how did where did that question come from? How did you know? Well, I didn't. I didn't know. I, I just wanted to know um, because I recently started taking it after I read that study that from England. Yeah, that that most recent one that it restores sort of like you know uh, sharpness to geriatric patients. And I gotta say that shit kind of works. I'm taking it with the you know with the black pepper biopene you know additive in it. And I have to say, and I have been restored. Like four or five of my IQ points have been restored to me. I'm pretty sure. Like I feel like I've been sorry. Listening. Really, really amazing. I, I'm sorry. I, I, I think it's a Bombay chicken, except for I don't eat chicken. Right. You just eat the Bombay. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I wasn't paying. I was paying attention to the live stream comments. Mark, what are you taking now? Turmeric. Turmeric. Oh, okay. Turmeric. Turmeric. It's got turmeric. Uh, I actually brought it up for Archie's friend uh, mm. because of the cancer uh, fighting properties. Right. I read. Oh yeah, I read about that too. It, it supposedly reduces inflammation, which of course is uh, inflammation and cancer are, are, are best friends, right? Correct. And they might. They, it might even help Alzheimer's. But you know, um, which is more or less why I'm taking it. But I kind of wonder if um, if if inflammation and cancer go hand in hand, then why is not my Celebrex a cancer fighting agent? It, it may not be. Mm. No, or maybe yes. Good to know. It's all gone pear shit. Where's Archie in his dad's house? No. Um, He's in the back yeah. on the phone. He's in the living quarters oh. of his own home. Normally, we see him in the studio, which is an outbuilding that his father built when he lived in that house and had his accounting practice in the backyard in that little building. That's where the you know. If I had, if it was up to me to rename the studio for 2018, you know, my choice would have been <laughs> what. Archie's Bunker Place. <laughs> well, after this, after, after this latest, after this latest rant, I am. I, I think that's a. I think that's a great choice. If I missed the rant. He had, he had a racist rant. Oh yeah, James totally Wong, racist. James Wong is saying CBD does not cure cancer. We never said it did, but um, no. C, but but CBD um, is reputed to have anti-inflammatory properties, also. Though. Correct, okay. and, it, and it also helps super, with Alzheimer's. $10 super chat. Uh, apparently, Dr. Bruce has brought out the East Asian. Anyway, whatever. The Canadian. The other Canadian. What? Um, okay. Dr. Bruce, Mark the Fairy Goldberg. Oh, come on, Tanzil. You're better than that. You are so better than that, man. Bring, bring it on. Let's go. Has has questioned why no one respects the Pelagos like the Submariner. Is this like when someone asks you why no one respects Costco optometrists like they do MDs? <laughs> Actually, I think the Costco optometrist has the, has the same optometry degree as the private practitioner. Um, I have to say that... <clears throat> I, I'm not I'm not a super Pelagos fan, so it may actually be very similar. Uh, I, I I like Tudor though. I do like like I like the new Pepsi that they've come out with. I would get the Pepsi Tudor over the Rolex Pepsi. You know. So I mean it's not like I'm hating Tudor. Oh, by the way, if you laughed at the earlier reference to Archie's Bunker Place, you're definitely over forty five. Yeah, or fifty five. Hey, um so in uh in, in Thailand, oh. when, you, when you go to yes, real quick, let's do a let's do a straw poll. Mark, hold your watch up. Now today, Mark is fortunately not showing us his ball. Either <laughs> one of them. My ball is now, if you like if you like the Pelagos more, type one. If you like the Submariner date, type type two. I got you by two millimeters and a better clasp. Show your clasp. Ugh. Open it. Sh show me that crappy stamp metal. Wait, wait, that wait. Is so, that's, so <laughs> that's so crappy, thin and sharp, you could shave with it. 
Okay, let's let's go. Let's go. Don't bring up shaving. Don't bring up shaving. That's a whole nother channel. Is that a is that a sexual reference? Did you you know? Like, I'm not sure what just happened there. Clive Clive buys razors. He has a five thousand dollar razor that he just bought not long ago. No, no, no. That is totally that is totally disproportionate. That is completely that is completely untrue. Bruce, is it true that you ask the nurses to allow you to shave the patients yourself from now on? Um, That's not true, right? It's a four thousand dollar razor. I just want to set it the is, matter straight. It is not. Oh, I, I said correct. It seriously is. It seriously is. It's a. Did it's a it limited. A corp? Did you buy it from a corpse or did you pay for it? Uh, I bought it from the corpse's kids. Honest to God. Yeah, that is the Gillette toggle red dot. It is a limited edition. It's in minty, minty, minty great shape. When it works, that thing and would be. It, Four thousand dollars if Adolf Hitler had used it to slit his own wrists. I mean, you know, like maybe then. Well, you could, he could. He couldn't use it to slit his wrists. That's why it's called a safety razor. <laughs> well, you know, if you if you kind of hacked away at it a millimeter at a time, you probably could. And by the way, if you shave with a safety razor, you could like peel half your face off. I don't know how many layers of dermis there are, but I bet you can go down at least five layers with that thing. I remember you mean, my dad. Okay, you mean leather up? I'll leather up right now and shave. Let's I will still leather, leather up and show you. I want to see, but you better have a toilet paper tourniquet handy. Bullshit. Okay, now Dr. Bruce keeps dropping in, on and off, in and out, in and out. I thought and you were doing that to me. Okay, let's go Let's go back. Um, uh, let's see. Bington Yay 3. Wait a, yeah, Bark and Jack. Hey, Bark and Jack's on the channel. Hey, um, crap. God, what's his name? It's like Christian from Theo and Harris. I actually like, okay, uh, Bark and Jack, I like your content. Seriously. Um, yeah. And also, my coffee's better than yours. <laughs> come, come, on the live, come on the live channel. Bring it. David R. says, lathered men shaving. Out, shaving. I'm out. <laughs> uh, Dave, oh, let's see. Two. David Strattenborough. Two. Andrew Brown. Andrew. Uh, Mr. You should have bought a Batman. Brown. Two. DJ Fatso, two. Evil Z, two. Logos, two. Logos normally hates my guts, too. So that's, you're actually, Mark, you're uniting all the trolls. Well, you know what? Uh, Dan says that he's logging off if Archie doesn't rejoin, and I, I might, I think I'm with him. <laughs> John Galt, two. Who is John Galt? Who is crappy watches and cheap horns? Uh, Christopher, for, Christopher, it's complicated. Oh, by the way, yeah. You know, actually, okay, Tanzil, two. Victor C, two. Um, anyway, let's see, looking for ones for, in all the wrong places, looking for ones in too many places, scanning the boards. Okay. Yeah, actually, Bark and Jack, seriously, um, Mark and Jack, Clyde Law, okay, at Mac.com, seriously, dude. Um, yeah. Hands on, sorry. Okay, let's, so what are we talking about? Oh, yeah, your Pelagos. And shaving. Shaving, well, yeah. Somehow or, man, somehow or another, Clyde turned it, you know, evil. But, like, I would like to know what is it about the Submariner that makes it worth twice the price? Horologically, Steve. Oh, oh. Okay, uh, here, here's a super step by Tansiel. This one's directed to me. Mark, do you want to read it since it's directed to me? I would love to, and um, I can personally say this is uh, this is as far from the truth as you can get. Clive Minuscule Cocked Angler, Guru Bark and Jack said, you could tell fake Rolex if the watch is scratched up. A Rolex is made of kryptonite and never scratch? Yeah, because if you're a real Rolex owner, you're going to be like... You're going to baby it? This. Yeah. What? Take this. Take my submarine out of the water? Are you fucking insane? You know where what? they really... Here, I'll tell you where they, they have really managed to um, – uh, where a lot of the fakes that I have seen fall short is in the bezel action. So it mm -hmm. can be very hard to tell from photographs. But they rarely put as much money into the smooth, crisp, um, ball-bearing action as the, um, as, the, as the Rolex Samariner bezel. So you get a cheap, tinny feel. If you know what the real one feels like, you'll, you'll never mistake a fake one. So for me, that's the easy way to tell, but you have to have it in hand. Yeah, because visually, some of these damn things look really good. 
Yeah, and well, I've actually been in, and like I said, so by the way, when are you going to start doing live streams on your channel, Mom? Well, you're going to teach me how. We had that conversation already. <laughs> hey, okay. Do you want me to go ahead and go on live stream and I'll show you how to do it? No, it not no. Well, we'll, we do it on we'll channel. It. He's totally not. He's totally not paying attention. We'll, I mean, we we'll could do this privately, but um, I am thinking about getting some food, bringing it down here, and doing a mukbang. What do you? What do you think? What do you think? Yeah, Actually, why not? It's that would be funny pizza. if uh, Archie came back and we were all eating pizza. Or how about if he came back and we were not here? Well, that would just be normal. See, so, I, I, if I suck, God, wait, wait. I might have administrator controls. Is there any way that I can undo the? I don't know if you've you already know? mentioned it, Mark. But what what do you say about the uh, the blue of the Pelagos? Well, you know, they got the black and the blue version. I, I wanted the blue when I first saw it came out. I was in my blue phase, much like Picasso. Um, it's a really interesting blue because it's it's constantly changing depending on the light. Oh, you've unmuted it. And it probably doesn't photograph well then. No, it, it really depends on the light. Like right now I'm in um, – here, hang on. Let me see what I can do to light it up a little better. I'm, you know, I'm not in natural light, and uh, so it doesn't really do a great job. but. You know, but boy, does but it it changes so much in the light. Here hey guys, light. how are you? Sorry about that. You don't think I was rude to him, do you? Oh no, not you were not rude at all. I uh, we have a feeling that uh, the uh, that the um, NAACP, the JDL, uh, the Indian um, the Indian Consumers League will all be protesting outside your house with pitchforks. With, with an, oh, with an, he's a cool guy. He's a cool guy. He's just he's just stupid, you know. <laughs> He's cool, but he's stupid. Yeah. Remind me never to piss, remind me never to piss you off. Holy cow! I say, oh, and, can, oh, uh, can, can I make a quick announcement? Sure, 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 sure. If you two would like your own telephone consultancy with Archie Luxury, please send <laughs> to Archie Luxury seventy two at gmail.com that's archie72 at gmail.com for fifty dollars archie will advise you on luxury watch matters he will insult your family your religion your race your sex your sexual preference if you pay him additional money he will insult the sexual preferences the race thank you and please give generously yes and please do not forget to submit your lineage and heritage and dna results going back three to four generations we need to know your race and makeup now here, here's a, here's actually the thing though. This is amazing. So we've got Mark Goldberg, who five thousand five thousand subscribers. Awesome. Ooh, super cool. How many did you buy, Mark? None, zero. We had that conversation. Oh, whoa. You need to take the two <laughs> minutes. Oh, that's harsh. <laughs> yeah, dude, dude. No, he already he already talked about this like five minutes. I swear yeah, to God, it's like I'm it's like, mentioning okay. it because some of my competitors do buy. Oh, I will say. Oh, Paul, no, I didn't buy any of them. I had to buy my mother. I had to buy my mother lunch or she would ref she refused to subscribe. So I bought one. Five dollars super chat. Sand zone, sorry. Arch, YouTube guru, Bark and Jack stopped by. Bark, and that's what I was getting ready to say. He wanted to let you know he thinks the men watch is as cool as filming shitty vids from a Brisbane park. Thank you so now, much. The thing, this, yeah, we actually had Bark and Jack on. I can't remember his name. It's like, you know, you, you can't remember Christian Theo Harris. Adrian. I'll just be one minute. Just use the soundboard. One minute. Sorry. One minute. I'll just be one minute there. I've got to get something. I can't wait till we have Jack and off. I will be even more. I will be even more impressed if we get Jack and off rather than Bark and Jack. But you know. and also Christopher, uh, Christopher, it's complicated. Is here. All right. Everybody uh, comes. To you, I, know, you know. Let's let's see if they've added anything new to the soundboard, shall we? Let's play. Archie buy a pizza. And garlic bread. No, actually, I I actually had lunch before I got on the live stream. Thank you, Amelia. Um, okay, F fucking protect Phil. Okay, wait. Hold it. Okay, well we have most watch reviews right there. The Brega, the Bregster, an Amiga Speedmaster, me on the mean. Shaga La Coutra. Shit, we may not actually need them anymore. <laughs> There's even one for that. Uh, I think on page two is one saying you don't need me anymore. Because I got a backache in loving you. Come on, man. Yeah, I mean, shit. Listen, we are just going to need uh, Paul's voice 
saying your name, my name, and Dr. Bruce's name, as well as Tanzil Anzari's name, and then basically we can we can we can we can cut him out of the herd. We can just eliminate him. And oh, um, okay, but you know, he would totally love that because then he would totally sit on his ass and collect no, super chat. No, you don't understand. We're going to change the super chat bank account. <laughs> he will. He will not love it. <laughs> um. Okay. So please super chat gener. I mean, please um, PayPal generously to Chicago Dog Trainer at gmail dot com. That's it. That's me. No, actually, it's Chicago Dog Center at gmail dot com. Or oh, Mark, okay. Or Mark Mark with a C. Mark Goldberg eight at gmail dot com. Gotcha. Now then, um, so let's see. Um, CMS, let's uh, Submariner trash the Pelagos. And you know, it's it's not bad. It's it's fun. It's fun. It's funky. It's it's got some flair to it. It's just a little too Invicta for me. You know what I mean? In the side. And, and your watch is a little. And I have one. I, I've got a. I have a pre ceramic. It's in a little too small. A little too thin. Like turn your bezel. It's real tinny, clicky. Look at your class. It's real you cheap. see, Mark, if you keep if you start if you keep eating the turmeric like Dr. Bruce suggests, <laughs> your eyesight will improve and you'll be able to see a you know a legitimately sized watch rather than the big. big you see, you've got you've got the jitterbug watch. Well, in your case, uh, it's being obscured by a little bit of hair. So if you will pull out your four thousand dollar razor, maybe you could show off that watch a little bit better. Either that or dreadlock yourself. We have a it looks like we have a serious super chat now. Okay, a six ninety nine super chat by Richard Greenberg. What is your opinion on the Glashuta original brand? I'm thinking about getting their steel cylinder with date. Okay, wait a minute, wait, wait. Um, hold on. Da, da, da. You know, actually, we need that. wait. I don't know what to say. Fiji's <laughs> fuck. Watches are all about snobbery. They're all about snobbery and bullshit stories. Fucking hell! <laughs> Half a dozen pieces of fucking shit. Okay, you want to go off and like do a crossword puzzle or, uh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> now, interestingly, I will say that uh, before I got into the channel, and gained a little more knowledge. I was actually looking at that and was thinking of getting one. Well, okay. La Chuta original is like the tutor to Lang and Sons Rolex. Right? Yes. Yes, it is. 100% right. Glass Hoot is the tutor of the Lang world. Yes. Not as cool, That's but yes. Damn good watch. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yes, yes. Damn good watch. Yes, can't can't argue with that. Okay. Don't trust those Germans, but you know that, don't you? Um, and you would agree yeah. that's a nice looking watch, right? At I don't want to. I don't want to be nasty, but my dad got the deal of the decade. Then the next day they release a better deal. They're not exactly well, trustworthy. You know, the Swiss are basically half German. Think about it. Ooh, that's nasty. That is yeah. nasty, Clyde. The Swiss, the Swiss are, are crowds that were a little bit better than climbing a mountain. That's, that's how they got in there. Um, all right. So $5 super chat. Archie, should I spend $400 on a play tonight or put it towards a watch? Actually, Neil, you could put as little as $200 into, into a uh, PayPal. And you could PayPal $200 of that to Archie Luxury. 72 at gmail.com and Archie will give you literally an entire evening's worth of advice on how to spend the other two to hundred dollars. And I've got an even better answer, I think. And that is, it depends on who he's playing with and how much fun she is. Right. Uh, okay. DJ Fatso. Oh, you know, okay. DJ Fatso. I'd, I'd love to read that question, but we kind of, we're kind of limited to uh, super chats here. So, you know, uh, Clive, start putting eyes and put. Stop putting eyes and put. I have no idea what you're saying. Okay, five dollars super chat by Tansil and sorry, Archie. What? Which is the most enticing sin to you? Mark Goldberg's sexual preference, gluttony with a bucket of KFC, HEV's personal German-made Pepsi GMT. 
How about having <laughs> sex while eating chicken? You know what I reckon? I reckon the, the biggest thing is selling the Porsche to buy a uh, exploder. I just can't get over it. I am so angry about that. I just can't handle it. Mark, I'm sorry. You were so wrong. You made the mistake of your life. I'm fucking furious. By the way, um, I'm like falling backwards off a building. What do you think, Doc? Do you think he's mad or not? Uh, it's, it's it's some sort of reverse um, <laughs> reverse robbery. Um, I don't I don't know how I don't know if he got the Porsche in the first place because you know he was it's having a, Porsche, a little Doc. crisis. Doctor, this is a reverse. Porsche is a Porsche. Do you understand what a Porsche is? They're an amazing car. It's not about top oh, speed. It's I not about. It. It's not about zero to sixty speeds. It's about dynamics, handling, build quality. Mark, you're going to learn about Ford build Listen, quality very soon. Let me let me help you understand this, and I think it will put everything clear. I own a Ford and four Brightlings. Don't you think that all goes together? Good point. I there you apologize. go. Come Hey, uh, Paul, how many, uh, how many Brightlings do you own? One. Only one watch per brand. You know the rules, Marky. How many, how many Brightlings have you owned all together? Oh, probably about half a dozen. There we go. Thank you. I rest my case. Every time uh, I've had a couple super... You went through three in a month. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, about just under 10, I'd say. I can get another Porsche someday if I miss it, but right now I'm not missing it. A Porsche is, it's pronounced Porsche when you own it. It's a Porsche when you don't own it. Okay. I said Porsche. Five, no, you said you Michael don't Ferguson. own it. You don't Super own a Porsche. Chat. Super you chat. It. Super chat. Michael Ferguson, Australian $6. I love Michael Ferguson. He's the white dialed two tone Daytona wearer. Love him to death. I sold mine along with my Porsche. Yes. And also, wow. also, if you want to see why Mark sold his Daytona, the most coveted Rolex of all time, you should subscribe immediately to Mark's channel, Mark Vlogs Watches. <laughs> I guess my wow. check cleared. I guess my it check cleared. Now, but, uh, Michael, okay. newer used in bangers. I, I, I want to hear what Paul has to say, but I'm saying don't buy anything in bangers. I think that's a I don't buy anything in bangers. Bangers is not cheap. They no. are slippery fuckers, slippery, Not nasty fuckers, okay? Slippery, nasty, dishonest fuckers, okay? Slippery, no nasty, fuck. dishonest, lying fuckers. Need I go on? And, uh, i got to tell you, this guy's starting to give me the fucking shits. Oh, okay, What's yeah. What's the advantage to buying in bangers? That's what I want to know. Well, there is none. And, um, there is none. There is no advantage of buying in bangers. Now, mind you, oh, I do it. one of my friends... Anyway. It used friends. to be cool, Doc. The, the really good sources for used watches and bangers are um, they're very private and you're not going to find them. So if you go into a brick and mortar store in Bangkok, you're just as good going anywhere else in the world. I was offered more discounts in Mexico City Rolex than I was in uh, Bangkok. Yeah. Uh, Bangkok yeah. is not cheap. Sure Sorry. Clive is take over. I just it's your show. I was I just saying it. we had quite a few. Slow down! Slow down! Exactly. We need to slow it down. That sort of collection should at least send me fucking fifty dollars. You cheap ass bastard! Oh, I'm sorry, Mark. <laughs> I'm afraid I, I love all my watches. I love all my watches, and uh, I love gay men too. By the way, I do love gay men. We've missed a awesome. couple of super chats. Well, okay. Match. I'm written. Not a problem. Arch, what do you prefer? Tanzone, sorry. Doing yes. body slides off Randy Munters while his ass hairs glitten, glisten off your skin. Salita Shitters or Colonoscopy Live with Dr. BBW. Salita Shitters. I'm wearing a Salita Shitter now. I love the Salitas. There's one before that. Go, scroll um, up. Big Burn. Hey guys, one of my Rolex Explorer one today in, in Edinburgh. One year waiting list. I want to trade my 2017 Explorer 2. Can you help me sell it? No. You're in Scotland. Matt Church, $2.99. <laughs> How's the AC2 Benz going? Well, he just found out he got the cheaper deal that came out the day after 
I got home and then on on the the, the ads in the corner of, of of Yahoo Mail, Mercedes Benz is talking about the Mercedes Benz C two hundred C edition. It's got metallic paint. It's got a sunroof and it's got uh, bigger wheels for two two thousand eight hundred. It's seven thousand dollars extra for two thousand eight hundred. You know, you imagine how my dad handles that. Mm. Oh, okay. Tanzil and sorry, five dollar super chat. Archie, can you give a personal shout out to my friend Ronnie Paul? Also, Ronnie Paul, thank you so much, Ronnie Paul. I've seen your comments everywhere. I love you to death, Ronnie Paul. I love you, Ronnie Paul. Are, is he a gay man? Uh, who cares? I love him anyhow. I love men, okay. no matter if they're gay, straight, bi, anything. I just love them, especially when they donate. I'm bisexual. <laughs> I'll get sexual. Ronnie Paul just got himself and Townsend. Sorry, you know I am homosexual. You know this, don't you guys? Yeah, in your in your design aesthetic, I think you mean to say. Yeah, I am. Actually. I am homosexual. No, I have sex no. at home. I have sex at home. I'm homosexual. Paul, Paul, does this mean that you'll give me a shampoo and a juice? No, no, no. no. <laughs> okay, let me let me finish the super chat by Tansiel. Archie, can you give a personal shout out to my friend Ronnie Paul? He got us on the VIP list to check out the new Rolex <laughs> Basel releases in Toronto May first. Shit. Yeah. Well, I didn't get any fucking invites. Oh, um, I think it probably had something to do with uh, carpet beetle embargoes. I can't, why doesn't anyone invite me anywhere? I don't get any invites anywhere. Weren't you invited to a special function from the uh, somewhere there in Australia? But they're not my friends anymore. I got they don't they don't respond anymore. What happened? Okay. What happened? <laughs> my personality got in the way. He talked to them. That's what <laughs> happened. He engaged them. <laughs> well, at least you're self-aware. My personality got in the way. I mean, that's a great line. I'm gonna use that. For I, was gonna suggest, I was gonna suggest it was something they said, but I don't know. Uh, oh, by the way, on that last super chat, you don't know what you're missing from my colonoscopy, so I, uh, I don't want to see you ragging on my colonoscopy. Can I see the? I think I saw the video on uh, you porn, Doc. Three dollars, three dollars, three dollars super chat from J. Rock. <laughs> Archie, can we have a carpet beetle related update? Actually, J. Rock. <laughs> actually, actually, J. Rock. Archie, actually, Archie does have a special limited. I mean, he does have a special carpet related update but that's only for patreon viewers isn't that right archie that's correct that's exactly right they're bastards you know that don't you or not what your patreon viewers no the fucking carpet beetles i've got all sorts oh. of health problems from them absolutely um okay awf uh, uh, ralph shepherd by the way I, I i like every time he shows up i like I, I try to be more mindful of how i portray myself um, do you do you see his avatar for Pete's sake? Ralph Shepard. Anyway, uh, oh, uh, Ronnie Paul, twenty dollars Canadian. Super chat, twenty dollars. Rarchi, wake sorry, up! Sorry, sorry. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Hello. <laughs> we'll give you some pictures from the Rolex event. Now, Archie, do you think? Do you think I want you video? Get... You got to put the camera on the side. I want video. Okay. Now, Archie, do you have any Pontiff-related memorabilia that you could send Arch, uh, Ronnie or Tanzil for the I distribute? Do. I do. I do. Like maybe, maybe. Actually, I think it's time. time I send Tanzil a special. I got a special limited edition print. Maybe you could send them auto autographed copies of your book, Luxury, Luxury to Last. Yeah. Now, how about an autographed copy of boxer shorts that you've actually filmed in? Okay. I, I tried to sell my shirts at one stage. And they didn't go the well. The underwear. The, the underwear is a, pr oh. is, is a proud tradition. It is a proven model. It works in uh, vending machines in Japan, even. Now, um, uh, Archie, J. Rod, $3 Australian. I'm not falling for that, Clive. Work with me. Uh, well, okay. Fair, well fisted, J. Rod. You can't blame a, you can't blame an enabler for trying. Oh, and by the way, um, you know, actually, Archie, how would you feel about doing some videos with Adrian from Bark and Jack? I'd be over the moon. I didn't think they wanted me to do anything with them. I was turned down before. Hmm. I was turned down. Soy Capitan. Soy Capitan. 
slide. What is that behind you, El Capitan? What is what behind me? What? There's some kind of like, um, there's some kind of hoe on the wall behind you. And I think this is uh, some kind of like new uh, sexual, uh, <laughs> I think like basically it looks like a uh, marry, torture, kill, like a bind, torture, kill, you know, print on the back. Is, is that woman dead? Is she uh, bound? What, what, 50 shades of gray men. What is behind you? Um, well, she <laughs> was bound. She now is dead, but I now have her watch. I see. I see. We have a super chat, but I'd like to come back I and discuss that. I saw it. Mercedes, Matty. Best wishes, AC two and three for Matt Church. Matt Church is joining us tonight on the on the Woo. chat. You know, you know, I'm not allowed to drive his car, don't you? You do know that. I mean, for all the videos I've I've done, yeah. you, know, you know, the son of a bitch. Oh. You know, the son of a bitch. Uh, Michael I Ferguson. Michael Ferguson. Cock dangler. Sorry. Well, I. <laughs> <laughs> you trolling me? Oh Here I use stock in Australia either. Mark, do you buy used Rolex in Chicago? Should I get them used from the U.S. import tax? Well, you see, actually, actually, Michael, you should you need to wait because once Mark uh, Goldberg hits six thousand subscribers, he'll be giving away a free Rolex. I will. You're you're wearing it right now. Show everybody. Show everybody that Rolex that I'll be. Giving I'm not away. wearing a Rolex. I'm wearing a bagel sport. Mark will be giving away a free bagel sport to. So let me for for the, for the, for those who do not who for those of you who are not American, let me explain how our how our state tax system works. We pay sales tax when you buy in the, in in your own state. So oh, I'm yeah. in the state of Illinois. Super and chat. I, Super chat. This, but this is a good one. Archie, are you with us? Yes, I am. Of course, I am. Ten dollars super chat from Tanzil. Arch, wow. If you no no that 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 if you email an autographed AC3 shirt. I will wear it to the Rolex event, and Ronnie Paul will videotape me telling the Rolex reps to work with me, not against me, big boy. How about that when, one with the collar? How about the one with the collar? The frayed one, the blue stripe yeah, one? Slightly, slightly frayed. That's got a bit of use left in it. Would that fit in? It's got a bit of no, use. It's partially in it. It's a sham wow. It's got a bit of use left. Listen, it, would uh, it, would, it would probably fit Tan Seal and Ronnie Paul at the same time. Live, if you live in the United no, States, no, you, no, are, you are better off. You're better off buying watches out of state and avoiding the sales tax. Yep. But of course, that would be wrong. And we would totally suggest you not do that under any circumstances. Well, there are, there are, there are ways and there are ways. Anyway. But if, for example, if you carry the watch away but have the box shipped to another state, you know, there, there's ways to do this, but not everybody will work with you. Some of them will work against you. So, okay. Yeah. Next slide. Can I tell you something I, I had happened to me yesterday? I don't know if you want to hear this watch-related story. I'll leave it with you. What? What? Watch-related news on Archie Lux and on Paul Polita? Yeah. What did we start this? It's kind of out of place. Yeah, I mean, actually, yeah. It does it involve ladyboys or carpet beetles? Or fisting. Okay. Or fisting. It, 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 it involves being polite to people when I want to tell them the truth. What do you know about politeness? Seriously? Okay, no, okay. I needed them to fix an invoice for me, Okay. Okay. okay, okay, okay. So they fixed an invoice purely for entertainment purposes only. Sure. And then, because I was, because they were doing me a really big favor, like a solid, yes. I had to actually listen to their sales spiel when they showed me this most fucking disgusting, awful wristwatch. They pulled out a Breitling Chronomat. <laughs> And they wanted. They proceeded to try and use high pressure tactics to sell it to me. Thank God it wasn't a tag. Well, no, no. Well, actually, well, no. The Breitling, the Breitling doesn't have a Salita, so he wasn't. So they, they, they tried to sell it to me for ten thousand. A Breitling Chronomat, brand new. It was twelve thousand retail. They tried to get me to buy it for ten thousand nine hundred. You mean that one with the in-house movement? It's a chronomat. Chronomat uses an in-house movement now. It does everything Breitling uses an in-house movement now? Although naturally, you can go buy it for like forty percent less a year old. Okay. Is so it in their house? I, it might have been in-house. It was a. But if can you believe that they wanted? They, I had to be polite and not say, "Look, I don't buy dogs. I don't." No, no offense, Mark. I don't buy dogs, and. Um, <laughs> uh, Every um, pun intended. 
yeah, yeah. every planet and, and and i had to be polite whilst they rang me half a dozen times to try and get me to buy it oh uh, now dr briss did you hear the news about mark's channel mark just, um mark you just a milestone right I did. Yes. By the way, I just looked, and I'm up to 5,006. And the, during the time of this video, six of you bastards have subscribed. Thank you. Probably not from this because there's probably no, only you probably, people you probably lost. You probably lost 30 from this one. There's so probably only five people watching. Now, yeah, that's really nice about the, what's really nice about this is usually what I've been told. Uh, what, I've been, what I've been told is a lot of times people get a little celebrity on uh, YouTube and they let it go to their heads. And Mark has not done that at all. I pick up dog poop for a living. How can it go to my head? What, did you just burn yourself? No, I just, never mind. Anyway, uh, $8 super chat from Matt Church. $8 Australian. Why are you wrapping up by a penny? Matt, well, taxes, I guess. Released an intermissal bluesy album yesterday dedicated to the Doctor About Moon Cities Enjoy. It's all about, it's all on your favorite subscription services, et cetera. Matt Church, Blues the Album. I got to check it out. All right. I don't know what to say. Absolutely. Actually, Matt, can we play it on your chat? Can we play it here? Tune into SoundCloud. Send us a link. Send us a link. I think that might be a dig on the fact that uh, I mentioned we didn't actually go to the moon. Okay. I think we're only allowed to play five seconds before we have a copyright infringement lawsuit, though. Jesus. Not if it's his song. Not if it's his song. Right? Not if he wants it on. He may, he may, have, congr he may have contractual obligations. For oh, example, I thought you were about to say self-respect. For example, well, that's a whole other matter. For example, I published a book, but I can't just like read the whole book out on, you know, on, uh, on, on YouTube because I've got contractual obligations to the publisher. No. Um, By the way, Mark, I want to give those books away. I'm going to promote no. that dog stuff. Okay. I'm just sorry. You know what I'm going to do, Paul? Is uh, I'm, I I haven't done it yet. I've been I've been crazy. But I'm gonna send you and Clyde each a personal ah! copy that you save. And then don't, what I'll don't, do is don't, 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 a bunch don't, of books to Australia. You just give me names of guys and I'll put them out in the United States. Be cool, so, Bruce. So right. Yeah, so that'd be great. Thanks. I'm cracking up already at the super chat. I'm cracking up already. Super oh, chat from Tanzil Ansari. Mark. Okay. The last <laughs> portion of the show to your channel, inspired by a ladyboy bukkake encounter from Archie's Pat Pong mongering past. Um, you know the the it, visual it, is just in, in, in enchanting. The visual on that. Yeah, it is kind of like a, a paint splat, um, and there was just something on the subliminal level that appealed, um, but that is, uh, it is a black splat. So, by the way, Dr. Uh, Bruce, are you fully aware of why urine is yellow and uh, uh, semen ejaculate is white? Do you really, do you know the actual reason for that? It's so that you can tell if you're coming or going. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Just letting you know. You got to know this stuff. I don't know what year you went to school. This is new development. I actually no. wrote that down. Wrote that down. We got two hours before I need to eat food. By the way, two hours before lunch. Are you kidding? You must have just okay. guys. If you want Archie to do push-ups, five dollars. Send super chat. Five dollars oh, a push. -up. Jesus Christ. We're gonna help you. Out. I'm five not. Dollars a, Listen, five dollars a push-up. Five dollars a push-up for five. Yeah. Five. How about shirtless sit-ups? <laughs> oh, uh, uh, Another couple okay. super chats. I don't know what. How about I jumping? Don't know how one hundred and okay. Shirtless, what, uh, shirtless jumping jacks. Super chats, gentlemen. One hundred and okay. I have no I idea what that is, but mm -hmm. it's a lot of them. Whatever it is. Hi. What is an in okay? It's a Swedish krona. Norwegian oh. krona is what it is. Okay, we're falling behind. Hey guys, great show. What do you guys think about the Vacheron Constantin patrimony reserved to Marsh and yellow gold with the JLC movement inside? Wonderful, Shitter. wonderful piece. Not a shit. That was, that was one that Russell Crowe had at the auction. You know that he had a similar piece. Uh, basically, 
you'd have to buy the paddock if you want to retain your value you've got to buy the paddock i mean jl bachelor is a great brand but fuck it 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 doesn't hold its own right you should you should get uh, fashion salita watches if you're really a true devotee of archie luxury <laughs> thank you yeah, i'm still uh, trying okay. to come to terms with that by the way could you please not say it so loud so no Solita. Okay, Neo. I, I want to cover my mouth because it feels like I'm saying something dirty. You know what I mean? Uh, Neo, $5 super chat. Everyone says to establish a relationship with your dealer, but the freaking sales tax alone makes that a non starter. How do you work around that? You That's go easy. to another state and you That's make a relationship right. with that dealer. Jewelers on time, fuckers. They're in California. I'm in Illinois. That's one of the ways I work around. Actually, Archie, you know, okay, wait a minute. California is is two hours behind us. So Doc, it's five, but it's five p.m. is California. Okay, Tanzone, sorry, uh, five dollars. Uh, super chat. I'll get. I got an idea here. And the Archie, sun's still shining. While, while you wear a fucking three hundred dollar Salida movement based watch on your wrist, please pitch Clive to sell his entire collection and get a pedic. Okay, oh. Clive. Clive, sell sell the lot off and buy yourself a. 5170 manual wine chronograph that'll solve all your problems in life. Wait, he should sell even the no, Archie, Archie, Archie. That's I'm disappointed. Funny. I am so bitterly disappointed because the Archie that I knew would have convinced me to sell it on his site mm -hmm. for a 20% commission. Well, Clyde, that's the next thing. I can help you. I can help you move those dogs. Actually, uh, I've been fighting with Clive to keep him from selling everything he has because he loves his bagel sport so much. You've been wearing, the, I've got to tell you something, that looks fucking realistic, doesn't it? I mean, be honest with you, from the camera, that, that, you know, it's a Hollywood camera. Uh, that looks like, it looks like, a, looks like a real one, doesn't it? And so far, so far it's like 15 seconds fast is about the only thing I can tell. Is it no more more automatic? It's automatic, is automatic. it? Automatic. What automatic. What's the display back like on it? I'll do that. Three dollar super chat by Richard Greenberg, uh, three or two seventy nine Canadian, which is something. Mm -hmm. uh, did I miss the horns updates? No, you did not. We were going to larger cans on the headphones to cover Wait, them. I tell you, holy shit! Okay, it's not a three two four movement, but by the way, update with the doctor. Okay, let me tell you what's happening with the doctor. Kids go back on Monday. It is a pupil free day, so they go back on Tuesday to school. And I've made an appointment with the pornologist. Okay. Are you going to see him <laughs> three AU? No, I've decided I've I've decided to forget the doc's advice. He's just gonna just gonna get it done cheaply, wow. okay? Can we get it done cheaply? I, I'm not. Look, I've got to be honest with you. My beauty days are well and truly gone, Doc. <laughs> so he's just going to whack them off, so to speak. Well, have you got social medicine, or do you have to pay for this? No, we've got social medicine, but I have to pay for surgery. The public hospital. Okay, how about if we had one of your doctors here? Just, just, just do a Google search on Jay Patel. What Jay if you were to go to Dr. 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 Patel. Just type in Dr. Patel. He, no, he's just standard. You've just offended every Indian on the continent of no, Australia. You just do a Google search on Dr. Death slash You're right. Dr. You're Patel. Right. So, okay. so you should film it when you have it done. Yes, I'm thinking. Paul, and put it Paul, on for Patreon viewers. Paul, have you considered <laughs> calling Paul, have you considered calling a veterinarian? Uh would it yeah, it'd be more expensive in my country. No, it would be cheaper. Anybody who does cattle, they will literally come to your farm. I'm looking forward to the post-operative appearance because um, you'll be helping Clive out when he's looking for the unicorn droppings. I mean, it's going to be interesting when you've got yeah. just one I, horn. I, in the back. I was going to see if I can put them in a bottle of methylated spirits and sell them on the channel. No, you slice them like like Einstein's brain into like very thin shavings. You could like actually. Make it I, th I think you should support the local homeboys. I think you should have an auction. Maybe, okay, on eBay, do an auction for, you know, they have to be in Australia, and have an auction for someone to come over, come over and slice the horns off with a uh, single, with a single 
single edge razor. If you can save them and shave them, you know, into real thin little wedges and serve them on toast points, you could actually turn a profit on this. Okay. Yeah, but 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 he does that. He has an auction with the Australian homeboy, Australian homeboys. They can pay. They can bid against each other for the to come over and slice the horns off. You would also have to bring, of course, part of that is getting Archie drunk enough to do it in pizza. You should have possibly, a man. Possibly Bruce. an Asian male in a dress. Okay, wait. Uh, Five dollar super chat by Tansil and Sorry. Archie pitch Mark Goldberg on Bias Salida based Patel Philippe from Bombay in your best Indian accent. Oh, Maki, 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 my friend, Maki, Ma, 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 Maki, my friend. I, 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 I. I, 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 Salita movement, reliable, reliable Salita movement. Uh, tag higher, tag higher. Same, I would like same, to say, same I, movement, Bell and Ross. Same movement, Bell and Ross. And I, would like to say, I would like to say, you sound like you from Calcutta or Brisbane. I do not <laughs> your accent, and I will not even buy a used car from you, my friend. Not even. No, no, guys, look, guys, guys, totally. And before I, let me address something on the live stream comments. Mm -hmm. And someone from somewhere, like where where did you say he was from? I oh, said he's from Canada. From South Asia. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, but he was paying us to do it, so therefore it's or, totally not or, racist. Or New Jersey. Yeah, or Jer I, no, you, actually, I, I, I do Canadian. love Indians. I really do. I, I no no bullshit. I've got some very good friend. I want to say hello to Rajiv who watches. I got a lot of Indian fans. I've got to tell you the truth. I love Indians. When I love Indian off. food. I when love they, Indian they, food they, is the best. When they is piss you when off, they're trying to buy your car. When they piss you off, Paul, do you call and complain to the Taj Mahal? <laughs> that's his favorite. That's his favorite Indian restaurant. He figured he'd get him fired. He said, "I'm going to call and I'm going to call and complain at the, to the Taj Mahal." <laughs> Now, and, to, and again, we, we like I said, we have an East Asian person paying us to do this, so it's actually it's actually enabling people from that area. So, I, think, I think it's only if, if he's doing it, it's okay. The rest of us can't really do it. We, we've missed a super chat. Matt Church, two ninety nine Australian. Why not three? Why two ninety nine? This is weird. Two thousand and eight Honda Accord V six luxury. For P plate kid, okay. I don't even understand the question. Can you interpret that for me, Clive? No, I can't. However, we will hit. We'll come. Uh, and I, oh, I, for P plate, I'm not sure what P plate means, but you know, people around, people all over the place, all kids, and you know, in Hondas, that should be fun. Have another super chat from Nate of Melbourne. You see it? Yes, I'm getting to it now. Hey, Archie, when yes. you do your superhero bit. And he turns shitters into dog shit. Will you miss your horror? <laughs> nice. I gotta be completely honest with you there. I I I do I do find it hard. I do find it hard, okay? The Salita movements, they're worse than ETA, aren't they? Guys, just be honest there, okay? We can't lie, can we? Well, it's an it's an it's an it, you know, if we you want to go completely serious about it, um, blah blah blah. It is a Swiss uh, movement still. It is Swiss. It's a clone of a generic. It's like one generation removed from shit. It's like it's like whale shit. It's actually yeah. lower than shark shit. Yeah, I don't. I well, don't know. no, it's a Swiss. It's a Swiss movement, but you normally have to go to a farm in the Alps to find what, a similar. What else could they have done? The thing the is, Swiss they were they were the ones who designed the original movement. What else could they have you done? The, you know, the best thing you can say about a Salita is that it's not a Miyota. That's the best thing you can say about it. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, here's a thought. Here's a thought. Not sell it for five thousand dollars. <laughs> and like I said, another. Another well, a watch guru who also I'm not going to name any names, but you know you can probably figure out. Basically, released a video and said, "Why all the hate for Tag Heuer?" I was thinking that that's a good point. Then I started researching Archie's watch. I'm like, "Oh, I totally fucking get the hate for Tag Heuer now. That makes complete sense. What what a bullshit ripoff." But hang on a minute, you, you know, know it, you don't say the same things when IWC uses Salita movements, do you? 
Um, well, that's that. No one's really brought that to my attention until you start using it as a defense to your buying one. I noticed there's no beers anywhere. Is anyone going to buy me a beer today? Buy him a couple of beers, guys, and he's yours for the night. Speaking of which, I got to go find dinner. What do you have to do now? Is, Doc, is it possible oh. that I'm actually digesting my own stomach at this moment? Could that happen? Um, your stomach is doing that in a desperate bid to attempt to attempt to escape this live stream. No, I'm starving. It, depend, it, it depends on if you've used us all your mucus on some other adventures. Dear God, what are, what what what, what okay. can I possibly have used up all my mucus on? Five dollar super chat. I don't chat know if I want to think about it. it. Sorry. <laughs> then, 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 then. I can't hear you. I cannot hear you. Hey, I just got some great news in. Guess what's happened, okay? Guess what just happened? A five dollar super chat from Tansil and Sorry. Sorry. Archie, is Tintinye good at which of the following? Performing live karaoke, cooking fried cooking kitten fried rice, or math? Malatio. Next question. Okay, thank you, Mark. Twenty dollar super chat by Snosius. Sorry, baby. When was the last time you hit your watch on something and what was it? Oh, I, I've hit a few things. I hit my my IWC. I I kept banging that because it's so big. I kept banging it. I hit it about a dozen times so far. Then I took it off, and I've also <laughs> I've also whacked my tag. Whoa! I whacked my Monaco coming into the office. It's now got a little. That little means thing. something else in this country, by the way. Mm. By the way, we figured out what the name for the studio should be in 2018. Yes. Archie's Bunker Place. Archie's Bunker Place. You wouldn't believe what's happened. Archie Luxury, the racehorse, has been doing some fantastic tricks. Okay. Fantastic right. tricks. Well, well yeah, because... I'm going to find out. some horse meat. I'll check back in with you later. Well, yeah, actually, I've, I've been reading about that. Apparently, the jockey is doing some underhanded shit before every race. He whispers in the in the uh, horse's ear, "You better win this fucker. I'm going to make you wear a tag Hoyer." <laughs> oh, Ving Tinye, five dollars. It looks like a fist. Thank you, Ving Tinye. Uh, three. Okay, uh, AC three, four dollars. Super chat, Woody New Yorker. Hey, Woody, how you doing? AC, tell us more about the rock star avatar. The rock star, it's just amazing. I, I've had the, the, so many dreams have come true. I have no money. I have no money. I always knew I'd be at the re wheel of a Rolls Royce or a Mercedes. I didn't realize I'd be cleaning, cleaning them out and driving people around in it. I always knew I'd be behind the wheel of one. And uh, I got to tell you, the rock star avatar, that's just amazing project. They're a really good band. Bra Brazzling's. Oh, Big Ten Yay, five dollars super chat sure. beer, Ooh, beer up. Thank you. Fuck me, Dad. I, I thought you bastards were never going to do it. I've had a shit week, but the yeah, absolute shit week. I can tell you that now. Things are not going good. I'll, okay, well, let me yeah, go and get yeah. the beer. Let me go and get my beer. Fucking hell. Also, thank you. Guys, thank it's you. not too late to five super chat five dollars to make Archie do push ups. Forget the fucking push ups. Yeah, you're gonna do it. You're gonna do it. You know the rules. They do Don't it. Don't worry about it. I'm going to a certain holiday camp later and they've got all the gym equipment you can muster and bad food so you don't put on weight. It also involves lady men, I mean, uh, Asian men in dresses, but we'll get to that later. I loved fried chicken before I became vegetarian. I don't know why I wanted to say that. Actually, Archie, the, the, Archie's going to the Purple Paradise Club. Archie weight loss tip number three: receive a full fisting. Be receive a fisting before fierce fisting before every meal to increase the feeling of fullness. Okay, uh, you know through a six pack, you know a six pack of beer in Australia costs 25. like twenty dollars. Twenty five. Uh, yep. Hey, Hey, boys, I got a present for you, but don't tell mom. <laughs> I'm going to let you talk to Barney Rebel. <laughs> uh, hey, yeah. Oh, mom. Tim Gurion. 
My son is going to medical school. What watch to buy? Okay, Tim, wait until your son finishes medical school and let him buy you a fucking watch. My answer is because of the change in his hours, it needs to have a lot of loom. I'd say a GLC. Isn't a GLC reverse kind of like a doctor's watch? Well, hey guys. Most I got to tell you guys. Hey, what happened to our Maki? Where's Maki gone? He got some he somewhere spell. Go. Hey, I just want to say to you. Now, I, I know you people, some people there have just have a problem with alcohol, but there's nothing. <sighs> there's nothing finer than a beer before 1030 in the morning. Hi, Archie. Oh, God, what do you say? You drink a beer like that. You drink it like a goddamn nursing infant. Every other man I know, I'm uh, sorry, every man I know pours it in their mouth. Not like he, he treats, he treats, he treats the bottle like a nipple. Yeah, Just exactly. A nipple, that's what he's doing. Okay, Paul Pluto, read the back of the bottle. It's very interesting. Read the back of the bottle. Well, oh, no, I'm sorry. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. He didn't super chat. He didn't super chat. I'm Never sorry. mind. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> it's it's beautiful. Beer is gorgeous. You know that? Does it taste better when you imagine it as a nipple? I've never thought think, of that before. Yeah, I, I totally would, actually, now that you think about it. Yeah, it's it's totally, very, it's it's <laughs> Not only do I get tipsy, but I have an erection as well. Um. Yeah, we might be not not want to talk about that. Okay, Mr. Gaddister, please tell me you got that. Please tell me you got that. Okay, Nate of Melbourne. No, Nate of Melbourne. How much to bet? How much to ban tags from the Archie Luxury and Paul Pluto channels? Who's tags? Tag Hoyas. Oh, Ooh. that's an interesting question, isn't it? How much to like ban? I think 500 bucks I'd ban them, okay? <laughs> Robin C says, but okay. the thing is, if I've got a Hoya, does that count? Well, you know, it could go either way. Much like Archie. And he, he, he mentioned everybody but trans in that when he said he loved everybody. So, yeah. I, I, love, I love the gender challenge people. They're very cool. Actually, the first thing, actually, hold the beer up again. The beer. Thank you, sir. When Archie wakes up in the morning, the first thing he likes to do is stay, stick his face in a Heineken. Heineken, official beer of Archie Luxury. I was going to say, the first thing he likes to do is suck on the nipple of a Heineken. I'm not fussy. My favorite beer is okay. free. Super chats, gentlemen. Super chats. Tanzil and sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, Tanzil, yeah. Tanzil and sorry. Archie, which of the following pieces should I wear to the Rolex VIP event with my homeboy, Ronnie Paul? A Datejust 2 Blue Dial Romans. Mm, Datejust 2. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Next, next, next. A Hulk. Ooh, yes. Explore two, yes, or or a Chuda BBB. No, you got to wear the Hulk. The Hulk is the coolest. So no, actually, no, 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 no. If he's going to go as a representative to Arch, as Archie Luxury, it should be either, it should it have to be the Explore two, Explore two, Explore two. Yeah, you, no, actually, yeah. I like the Hulk though. The Hulk is cool. There's, now there's a super chat just above that. Oh, does Heineken taste like anything like Ladyboy nipples? Says Holder F three three three. I think we have to give that one to the Pontiff. I got to tell you the truth. There's nothing better than a uh, a Thai lady or Lady Boy with Heineken spread all you know, over here, them and licked off here, by the Pontiff. No, I'll here's here's the actually the oh yeah. Go ahead and take a personal phone call. That's great. Yeah, sure, great, right, sure. By the way, hello. You call that a horror? I, I, 
Hey, Bruce, can yes. you do an, a good Australian accent or not? Good day, Bruce. Good to see you, Bruce. Top of the morning, Bruce. Well, I was going to say, you know, kind of like the Paul Hogan. The, oh, my God, they're both named Paul. Who's this? Is Crocodile to Dundee horned? I mean, you think that's why he wears the hat all the time? Could be. Could be. I thought it was Could hide the unicorn ball. one, too. Yeah, true. Triceratops. Hey. Okay. You're um, so horrible. I loved you. I got a tattoo of your Camaro on my butt for you. I hate Camaros. They weigh a lot. It They're can come slow. off. What's this? You're not going to apologize. I don't even want to talk anymore. Hey, hey. Hey, we can fix it up. Don't worry about it. We can fix it up. We can fix it up. Sweetie. Sweetie. I didn't fucking care. I didn't fucking care. I didn't fucking care. I didn't fucking care. Did she hear? Please tell me she heard that. I don't know. <laughs> what did I do wrong? What the hell was that, by the way? Oh, uh, it was just, you know, it's one of these Tinder dates that went bad. <laughs> oh, bad, yes. They That'd asked for money. They asked for money at the end. I of think it. she hit it on the head. It is a little bit small. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh god! Oh my god! I can't get my breath. I can't get my breath. I've had a few of those. At least you're man enough to admit it. Hey. Sometimes if a woman is too attractive, be careful. She might be a lady boy. Yeah. Here's the Oh, here's the funny thing. You know, actually, my spot, sorry, this guy I know, um, was actually in, did, was in the Air, Korea Air Force. He was stationed in the Far East. So we kind of brought up the lady boy thing. And he said, oh, yeah, and this is like 70s. And he's like, oh, totally. He's like, uh, when, I was in, when I was there, he's like, the most attractive women that were there were not women. And he said, the, app, the Adam's apple thing isn't always a get isn't always a giveaway. He no. said the only way that we could really tell, the only that way that we could really tell is that the, at that time Thai women were very demure, demure. So uh, if it was, if, so if a really attractive woman woman came up to us, we quickly figured out it wasn't a woman. I, I guess also they probably also figured that when she started pulling her cock out. <laughs> but but so that's not relatively recent. That's like forty years ago. Wow, that's amazing. The Adam's yeah. apple is genetic. So there's a there's a, some oh. variability there. Flat Pat Costco had that shit in Monaco for a year and a half before some wanker bought it. What was the price? Mm. I don't know. Price is everything. Okay, do you th well, Archie, you believe that sometimes you should we should give the punchers value, right? Because you care about your viewers. Yeah. Because you love them, you love them like gay men. Yes. He's gonna yes. hold up the bagel sport. No, 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 no. Guys, okay, it's 723. For the next seven minutes, if you want to write any, type anything in the live stream comments derogatory about Tag Warrior or Salida Movements, I will read them for free. <laughs> Starting. That's because you, yeah. you want to. <laughs> oh, I totally want to. Uh, black Pudding versus Bagel Sport. Matt Church, I, well, I'm not familiar with the Black Pudding. I'm going to say that's some form of a tag. Okay. Um, have another, Arch. I'll have one with you. Vington, and have another beer, Arch. Oh, his money came in? Yes. Black uh, pudding okay. cannot be good. That's all I can tell you. AC, on the Ladyboy theme, can you sing us the chorus of Dude Looks Like a Lady from Aerosmith? $5 Super Chat by Woody New Yorker. Sure, we can do that. What's it called again? Dude Looks Like a Lady by Aerosmith. I don't remember that one. Finding it now, guys.
you s Aerosmith. Oh, Aerosmith okay. was so cool. You know that? Um, Phil Champ, yeah. Uh, Selena is cheap to fix. That's a pot. No, I'm not going to read a positive for free. Yep. If you may read a positive for free about Selena or Tag or you have to pay. That uh, that dude looks like a lady, dude. That dude looks like a lady. That dude looks like a lady. When are you going to sing Aerosmith? This is it. It's just going. Got the beat going in the background. The lyrics are coming up. You know this song, don't you? I got the tune going. Cruised into a bar on the shore. Here, picture Grace the Grime on the door. Church she had a long list, love at first bite. Baby, Jackie maybe Queen. you're wrong, but you know it's all right. It's right. That, 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 that. Tack and pull that back. Backstage, yeah. we're having the time. Of our lives until somebody say, Steve McQueen handed the monocle. If I had seen him out of line, then she whisked out her gun and I tried to blow me away. Dude, 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 that's it. I looked like a lady. Dude, that. Dude looks like a lady. Heard fewer. Dude looks like a lady. There you go. How's that? Right. Tarts Thanks corner. I got another beer. I got to drink another beer. I've been told. Is that correct? Yes. Movado is a better brand than Tag. Tag is a department store shitter. Okay. Tag Heuer is the kind of watch they don't even make fakes of nowadays. I like the uh, Tag York. Tag Black Pudding. Tag York. AGV uh -huh. Pepsi Beetle. Uh, okay. Tag right. black pudding versus pepperoni. What do you Hello? think? Hello? Hello? Will you ever turn the mic down? No. Goldberg Hello? had to eat. But me dead. Hello? Uh, five second, please. Guess that was worth uh, And Uwe and McGavister, you know what you have to do now, boys. You know what you have to do. Uh, Chris, yeah. Stephen Tyler would approve, says Dan Ross. Okay, Oscar Madison, if you want him to sign if you want him to sing Sign of the Gypsy Queen, I'd actually kinda like to hear that too. You know, actually you need to super chat five dollars. <clears throat> Two bucks uh, super chat about the volume. Robert Robert Padilla, by the way, he's wanting to know the uh, watch review. <clears throat> yeah. Robert, uh, Robert, I'm working on it, man. I've just got to get my mojo back. I gotta get my mojo. It's coming, it's coming. Robert, I haven't forgotten. No one's been forgotten. Just re relax for a minute. Robert says, I had a tag for about three months. The fit and finish wasn't there, so I traded it for another watch. Thanks for the late review, motherfucker. When when did he send me the payment? Can I ask, ask Robert that? Because I can find the fucking thing. I can tell you if I've done it or not, based on that. Okay. Uh, Kelsey, what's $2? Arch, Arch, how much to permanently lower your mic volume? Oh, fuck. What's wrong with the mic volume? They can hear Some you. People think it's loud. Fuck. I didn't think it's that loud. It's on the lowest setting. Jesus. Really? Uh, tag sells sports. Tell, we have two more minutes of free derogatory tag order comments. Tag sells quartz watches for $1,200 to stupid buyers. They sell $5,000 Salida movements to... Re Never mind. Um, that's okay. Tag, tag Stephen Tyler Pudding. Tag is worse than Seiko. Archie, Stephen Queen's Monaco versus... No, sorry, Ricardo, that's actually Will Com Fossil is better than Tag. Nice. Robin C says Tag is Seiko. They gave me a free book, but you know that? I kind of feel obligated. Hotsy wants to know, have you ever had Mojo? Big man, one man says Tag kills Mojo. Is there, I need to have pizza today because tomorrow they charge fucking ten percent more. You need to order pizza. You need to be sending some money soon because otherwise I gotta. Robert Padilla said I super chatted on oh, April sixth on that twenty minute live stream. Fuck April sixth. Yeah. What were you doing April sixth? Oh, <laughs> just tell Robert. Can he send it to me again and I'll do it today. I want to get this one nut, nutted out immediately. I'm going to do that video 
Well, do you want? Do we want to have maybe do something? No, no, we want to. I'm going to do it individually. Send it. Just tell them to send it to archieluxury72 at gmail.com. Robert, send it now. I'll do it today, and it'll be up there within a couple of hours. I'm going to do it. Matt okay. Church. I'm going Matt to ring Church. the car. I'm going to ring the car dealer, student and tell him what I think of his deal. If you don't mind. Matt Actually, should, well, wait a minute. Here's why I think Now, if you guys don't want to, I, I don't think you should do it for free, or I think you should do it. Okay, can Archie sing Lola by the Kinks? Richard Greenberg, five forty nine, five dollars, five fifty super chat. Arch, you need to sing Lola by the Kinks. Lola, the money's come in. Yes. Yes, it did. Lola, Lola. Ki oh, Kinks. Lola, the Kinks. I know Lola. The Kinks are cool. They were Lola. really cool. You know that. Kind of like how Hoyer used to be really cool, but then they turned into. Met her in a club down in Old Soho. Drink your pain and taste like like cherry cola. See a cola. Ah, fuck! Some cunt's ringing me. Just hang on. Hello. Hello. Watching. Jay Pastor said. Padilla paid like three times for the same review. Yes, he did. Uh, all our ribs. It's waiting for you to pick up. Okay, how much I owe you? What? This is the number you gave me for order. Your order has been ready for half an hour. My mind is changed because of I thought you delivered it, no? Fucking exorbitant prices. No, please, what the and, uh, you from? I didn't, I didn't think I ordered it. Okay, Has it been paid? I, 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 love I love all my watches. And, uh, oh, I love I love my watches. Watches. Yeah. Whereabouts are you? Boy's desire for sexual activity. And the Where about is that? Of this particular <laughs> specimen's <laughs> Whereabouts are you? And then later on, I went on holidays again with them, with the lady boy. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Shit, I don't even know where this food yeah. is. I've got to pick it up. You know, I don't want wasted food. i got to have another beer, guys. Someone's already I'm having to trade this shit of friends in. No worries at all. Fuck you, you asshole. You Fuck you, you, you nasty, vicious, salmon of sniveling pieces of shit. You fucking cunts. Okay, McGaddister, you are fucking awesome. I mean, seriously. I don't know how much free time you've killed in America with this soundboard. Oh, by the way, how can people get access to the soundboard? They can get access to the soundboard by sponsoring me on Patreon for as little as a dollar a month. You'll get access to the soundboard. Okay. Robert Peter wants to know what kind of food did you order? I didn't order it. They, someone ordered it for me, and I can just imagine I'm missing out on young cha spring rolls and dumplings and 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 and, and duck. Uh, Matt Church says, send the soundboard to Mercedes. No, they he's not. Okay. Uh, how much for banning the attention whoring lawyer, says Tom834848. I was Clive just about to say, I think we can ban Clive from you, Clive. I tell you how much we can ban Clive for, right? $100,000. That's how much he adds to my channel. $100,000. $100,000 will ban. Clive. I think well, the was in there. Oh, wait. Is he on the phone? Oh, oh fuck me. Awesome. I'm going to teach this fucker to get on the phone on a live stream. Fuck you, assholes. Fuck you, nasty, vicious, foul mouth, sniveling pieces of shit. Yeah, yeah, you I'm here. Fucking cunts. Last time you come in, you his desire for what? sexual activity and the tightness on, of this particular. Specimens. Why is that? That is a stunner. It's a winner, winner, winner. Oh wait, wait, wait. I see. The suck of my husband. I was doing that experimental phase. Okay. Yeah, that's correct. You eat all the lady boy. You don't eat all the crap. You'll take so much more than that. I, 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 I still think his dick's for pissing out of John. 
I, I do have to tell you this, I will make a small confession. She did look a lot better without any clothes on than with clothes on. Okay, okay, okay. You, you never trust you anything bad, coming in a woman's mouth and stop looking at her tits. You never trust anything coming out of a woman's mouth and stop looking at her tits. I can put my toes in my mouth. Did you know that? To bite the beetles that are infesting my feet. Are they still on the phone? He muted it. Well, he's getting smarter. I have to hand him that. At I think we were smarter. overwhelming him. That was perfect. It was just perfect. It was just everything was just lining up. McAdister, you're the fucking guy. I could swear the guy said, quit screaming at me or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> and then he put it on mute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah, but we definitely got some in on him before that mute happened. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you're gonna take, yeah, if you're going to take phone calls during your own live stream, you deserve it, dude. You kn he knows we've got these boards open. He knows it. He ah, knows now. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, doctor, what are you up to, man? Well, I'm still going to be leaving out for happy hour in a few minutes. So we'll see uh, what's out there. Matt Church, $3 Super Chat. Ring Mercedes dealership with soundboard. Um, I'm not going to – well, actually, they're closed over here. They're probably still open in Australia, Matt, Matt, Matt. But uh, as you can tell, the Pontiff, using the highest standards of professionalism in broadcasting, actually, he's part of the excrement and broadcasting system, the EIB. Uh, Archie has stepped away, so the bananas are now in charge. Now, is that BBW happy ending hour? Let's hope it is. Let's hope it is. Uh, oh, that would be that. nice. Yeah. I could use it this week. Hmm, looks like someone else is leaving for happy hour. I saw. Hmm. Said the blind man. Yeah, exactly. Oh, wait. Nah, fine. That's such a great one. I see. I see. You see, we uh, <coughs> see. I see, <coughs> McAster. If we could, uh, there, if there's a better way to organize them into, like, say, Archie explodes or sex or lady boys or watches, and that way we could just literally pull it up and just. Um, oh, Richard Greenberg. Yeah, the 1530 is great. Are you going to adjust the bezel on it? Uh, the chapter ring. I'm sorry. Yes. Hey, guys. How are you? Good. I'm eating some snack food, by the way. I'm a little bit peckish today. These are chili and lime. Oh, wow. i got to have another beer. You know that? Um, okay. I know. You tried. So, uh, hello, hello. It's an hour and 40 minutes. Can you hear us? Hello. Just call in to confirm your appointment for tonight. The bachelor party. I've actually, I did go into a lady. Uh -huh. I'm confirming your appointment. Okay, no worries. Fuck you, assholes! Fuck you, nasty, vicious, salmon of sniveling, pieces of shit! You fucking cunts! Fuck you, assholes! You fucking nasty, vicious, salmon of sniveling, pieces of shit! Nope. Let me assure you, our ladies have twice as much to go around. Well, it's like you're getting four strippers for the price of two. Have you got two. fucking mental okay. problems? Have you got a fucking problem with your long Can you just cover me for a minute? I'm going to get into your nuts. Please provide... You don't believe! 
All right. Jeez. I don't want to. Someone, I someone said I didn't have real beer last time. They, they said like to them. me. I like them. Wait, did someone pay for that one? Yeah. Uh, you, you said they did. No, I didn't. Wait, is that your second or third one? Second, second, second. Are you sure? So, oh, how many no, strippers no. do you have coming there, Pontiff? Wait, wait, Hello? wait, 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 wait. Hello. Hello? Fuck you, assholes! Fuck you, nasty, vicious, fucking spilling pieces of shit! You fucking cunts! We have been hired by Steve from accounting. Steve is disappointed about this and is very ashamed of himself. That's two dollars. Why? Why don't you like him? What? What? Inept, cheap, final. Fuck it. See, yes, yes. He put exactly. his headphones on in there, Clive. Oh, uh, it's too bad. I can't see. I can't see when he's. I can't see when he's. <laughs> you know, you think. You think after the first two or three times he take he quit taking personal phone calls in front of us, but new. No, but he, he put his headphones back on. Yeah. Anyhow, guys, I'll put that on silent now. Tell me this, Doc. Yes, sir. That dial's well, coming tomorrow, by the well, way. We, we have an offer for you to get pizza, okay? Oh, my God. Will you tra Kurt Rafferty wants to know, will you trade your NG for a piece of pizza? Uh, no. And another song to sing. Yep. Kev's Lament by Kevin Bloody Wilson. $5 Super Chat by Stephen K. Oh, that's a bit nasty, that guy. Kev's Lament. Well, you, five dollars super chat, Arch. I'll get it. One minute. Uh, it's all about gun pear shaped. Eat some more garbage, fat cell. That'll help you lose that extra hundred and fifty pounds. Oh, sorry. Oopsie, that wasn't a free one. That was a free one. Uh, okay, Stephen King putting Pete. No, sorry. Tips with pizza and ice. Oh, Stephen King, yeah. Stephen King said, well, love this song. One minute. It's coming. One minute. That's a, a bit of a nasty song, Clive. You know, this, this Kevin guy, he's not really, it's he's okay. not really that friendly. <coughs> I'm trying to find it. I'm trying to find these the lyrics. You're going to send me things. you got to find me things I can find the lyrics to easily, you know? I think the mighty Max Million is the only one who shouldn't hear it. The rest of us can probably... Oh, Max is on the board, is he? I didn't see him. No, he's probably been banned from ch coming, in the, coming on the channel after his parents saw the watch. Oh, Okay. <laughs> Jesus, how are you guys going, by the way? Tell me this. Shit. Well, I'm not going to say anything more. I'm not going to... Okay. I might be having, like, an earth-shaking announcement tomorrow. Wish me luck, guys. Don't count your chickens. I know, I know. Wait a minute. I was going to say it tastes like chicken. But anyway. Hello? Uh, this is how long from one Chinese restaurant. I called you before to pick up an order. This is Oklahoma. The person came up and picked up an order, and the phone number was wrong that I called. I wanted to offer you free food because of wrong phone call. We will deliver to your address. Okay. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, no, no. one. order of orange chicken and all our ribs, some sweet and sour pork, uh, chicken homemade, and some shrimp fried rice. Okay, dude, I'm in Oklahoma City. You got to know that when you call me internationally. Yes, wrong Chinese restaurant. No, you got the wrong What's city. Your address so we can deliver food to you, okay? Um, <laughs> yes. Oh, oh. You, you're out of our delivery area for Wong Chinese restaurant. You can pick up your order from Wong Chinese restaurant. 
Okay. I'll be there in about four days. Thank you. <laughs> you know, you know, you know, Archie Luxury at One Chinese Restaurant. Chinese food is good for you. It makes you healthy. It gives you lots of energy. I'm now one Chinese restaurant, and I approve this method. All right, Wong number. The call was from Brisbane, Australia. I shit you not. I know that was that wasn't I fake. I, I I don't know, it, but the call wasn't fake. It actually, you know, you know. I almost want to call them. Okay, guys. Let's see. Wow. Huh. That Let's is go. amazing. Well, how, how would someone... Yeah. Wow. Okay. I got to tell you, Clive, in all honesty, right? Are you considering right. selling off everything you've got to get... A really expensive watch that could be the way for you to go um no i don't know. see which ones would it be you got about eighty thousand in watches haven't you no i've got like uh, two or three boxes You ever thought about selling everything and getting one amazing watch? God damn it, mm. is Rudy pinning you up? Sorry, is Duty pinning you up to this? Uh, that wouldn't work. That wouldn't work. Can you have one, Doc? What about you? Could you just have one and be happy with it? Well, I could be happy, but I couldn't be the happiest. So if I okay. had to have one... I could choose one to be happy with. By the way, Doc, the guy sent me the, the dial, by the way, because he couldn't photograph. The guy's a 65-year-old guy, right? He said, I can't photograph this thing. He sent it to me. Wait, said, oh, but you have a camera. Guys, look. Here we go yeah. again. Do you see this number? Is that like that's a, like a, that's like an Australian that's a number, Brisbane right? number. Yes, yes, yes. Hello? Oh, hi. How are you? Great. What can I help you with? Your girlfriend with? asked me to give you a call to set up our, <laughs> well, you know. Okay. Um, Carmen, I'm sorry. I, I thought she told you that I'd be calling you. Carmen, you know I'm in Oklahoma City, right? You know where Your Oklahoma girlfriend, when I met her last week, she said you guys talked about me. <laughs> she told me all the details. Look, we all have troubles at my age, okay? Look, if I don't get a good night's sleep and plenty of fluids, everyone my age has troubles. Baby, you know you want this. Just to let you know, when I do this with other couples, I like to go over to their place. That way I feel like I'm the special guest I'm meant to be. You know. <laughs> okay. Uh, please send... Please send... Please send... Please send... Please send pit pics to archieluxury72 <laughs> at gmail.com. Are you still there? Mm. <laughs> I'm Paul Pluta, and I love Lady Boys. Clyde, I think yes. to make you feel at home, she wasn't listening to anything you said. Well, that's just like every goddamn woman in my life. So why should you? Yeah, I'm totally used to it. Been married twice, and fucker. All right, uh, that's okay. This is the lyrics, genius.com. Backslash Kevin dash bloody dash Wilson dash Kev's lament. Okay, it was over lyrics. Okay, All right, it. so you mean to you mean email that to you or not? Or I'm finding it now. Or you mean to fly to Australia and pull up? Never mind. Yeah. Talk to me, Clivey. Clive, it's a black pudding call. This, this guy is somebody's lawyer. This is just so dumb. Enjoy all the spam, spam calls now, Clive. Well, you didn't see my number, so... Hey, wait a minute. How the, how the hell would... So... Here we go, Clive. Do you want me to, I'll sing this for you, okay? Do you want me to sing this for you, Clive? 
Just before yeah. you sing, uh, just for everybody else to know as well as myself, are you also doing a broadcast tomorrow? <clears throat> of course we are. Very good. I'm going to have to bow out now. Uh, someone pointed out I have oh. something slightly better to do. A little happy hour. But I will see oh, you later. What's, what's down a happy hour? Can you just, 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 just fill us in? What is on a happy hour there? What is there that you caught your eye? Um, a buddy of mine just gave me like three thumbs ups in a row. So apparently I need to get going. I think what's back? I told him what I thought of his fuck knuckle company. <laughs> One of my wingmen. Uh, okay, you go. Just, just go, Doc. Doc, Doc, Doc. Just go. Just go. You're going you're gonna to do well there, so, Doc. Okay, okay, good. West Virginia, David R. Probably not. Probably not. Okay, you want to call it an evening, or do you want to? Oh, well, you still have to sing the song, don't you? And guys, and here's what's going to happen. I want you to send me the most demeaning, degrading comments you can. Slip them in whenever he takes a breath during the song. Okay. Okay, West Virginia, David R., you're obviously new here. Oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ, this guy's a bit over the top, Clive. I don't know if I could actually sing this stuff. He's a bit on the nasty side. Clivers, are you disappearing on me now? Where are you going, Clivers? Well, it's it's been like a couple hours though, dude. I mean, isn't that long enough? I mean, how much how much yeah. value do we have to give him? <clears throat> Clivers, I want to say thank you so much for joining me. You're a great friend. And uh, we'll be on tomorrow. Yeah, uh, for a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. Clive, yeah, you take care. I love you. You take care. No, no, and, no, no, uh, you, uh, let's, I, I can stay long enough to hear you sing the song and trash your reputation further on the internet. So okay, let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is this. The song is called Kev's Lament. Should I fuck on first dates? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, they they want to know what. They here we go. What is he, he's singing the guitar. I remember back on our first date. I, I'm in the back of the me car. I wanted you to go all the way, but you wouldn't go that far. I wanted you to hold me, Dick. Uh, you wanted to hold me hand. And when I accidentally brushed your tit, it just blew it and came in my pants. I'll never forget the strain and the sweat as I fumbled with your gear. A hundred degrees with the windows wound up so your mum and dad couldn't hear. Trying my best to unzip your dress and unhook your bra with one hand. And just yeah, when I thought really I was doing all right, I came in my pants again. <laughs> How's that, Clivers? That's good. By Kevin the way, Bloody man, Wilson. Big man. Not as bad as Rodney Rude. Now, Big Man, one man basically figured out what tag stands for. Mm. Tell that me. ain't good. That ain't good. Clivers, thank you so much for your support. We'll be on tomorrow. Thank you. You go and have a good what night. Time? What time? Same time, time? Same time, same channel, fuckaroonies. Okay. If if you're in America, that's 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. No if worries. America, if you're not in America, who fucking cares, really? I mean, thank well, you. No, I mean, it's all American based. All American. Google ads. Google ads. See you later, Clivers. Love you. See you tomorrow. Ciao.